step-by-step -step instructions Good. on how to change the monitor on an Acer 5250. Um, first thing, you want to make sure you unplug it and remove the battery um, out of the way. Then you get your packet open from laptopscreens.com and make sure you open it, get everything set up. Um, you will need a small flathead and a Phillips screwdriver. Um, you take out your screen, set it aside, um, open your laptop, and at the bottom there's some little tapes covering some screws. You just take those off. They're a little hard to take out, but you just remove those. Then with the Phillips, you go ahead and take those screws out and make sure you don't lose them. It's better if you do this on a nice area where you can just, if you drop something, you find it. Because if you do this on the air, on the couch, you lose these things. Then you slowly put your fingers on the side of the screen and go around the whole thing, pulling it open. Just carefully that you don't break the frame. One snap at a time. And then just lean it all the way open so you can actually get it out of the entire place. Set it aside. Then you go ahead and unscrew the monitors from the um, from the side, get a couple screws, um, four screws, take those out, make sure you don't lose those screws, Slowly lift it up. Cables are plugged in on the back. You just gotta be careful with them. You don't break them. You just get them taped. Now you're gonna remove the monitor out of this frame by removing the smaller screws. Be careful you don't lose them. Set them aside. And these screws are actually smaller than the first ones that we just took out, so don't mix them. There should be three screws in each side. Next step, you're going to have slowly unplug this cable back here. It's normally tape the back of it. Just got to lift it up a little bit so you get the tape out.
So just once you get it out, make sure you peel the tape back a little bit. Move the old monitor out of the way. Bring the new monitor in. And you're gonna slowly insert the monitor back inside and the cable back in, plug it in and then tape it all back down and that was the hard part of it now you just gotta screw everything back together reverse order or take, make sure you take out the, the covering tape it has a plastic film covering the screen So now you just put everything back together. Um, don't over tighten the screws. Um, you don't want to break the, your new monitor. Slowly move it around. Get your next set of screws. Line it up with the top one. And the bottom one. Third one, one oh, hole. There it goes. <clears throat> now we are laying it back again. Make sure nothing else is broken there. Clean it back. Um, so you make sure your cable is out of your way. Have your four screws, little black ones. You know, easier is to put the top one first. And the bottom ones. Now you go ahead and place your cover inside. Start clipping it back together. Then you take your last two screws, put them at the bottom.
and take the little tapes and put them back in there. Make it all nice and pretty again. And there you have it. Now we just make sure that everything sealed back up. Close it, put the battery back on it. And turn it on to make sure we have a good working monitor. There we have it.